Cause the Clippers right just play too. As far as like, uh, you know, kids trying to go to the NBA over school. Yeah. How we need more doctors. I think the times just changed because if you think back to like in the nineties and eighties. The men, like, they want us to look up to were the guys who went to college, went, you know, got degrees, became doctors. Over time, I think people got younger and started getting richer at a younger age. So now kids seeing these 20-year-olds that's getting $50,000. You know what I mean? Like, so it's like, oh, I don't got to go to, that whole idea of I don't got to go to school to be successful and famous started getting bigger. And I think that's what made niggas like, I don't got to go to college. And, and then, I don't got to go to work. And I don't got to go to work. For seven jobs. And then yeah, it's like. Facts. Yeah, but like at social media, bro, like that shit made niggas. Power the internet, yeah, bro. bro, like niggas, like oh, I can just do this from home all day and make ten thousand dollars a month. Like, not I for go nothing. Like a lot of the game, even stuff like anything you. Sensitivity so separately. Yes. Nah, yes. No. Listen, but I was why? gonna get. I was gonna get into that because last that at work. You're the first person I thought about. Yeah, you was literally the first person I thought yeah. about. No, so um, at work we talking about college experience. <laughs> We talking we talking about college experience, bro. And so I'm like it, it was me, P and all of them. So I'm like, yeah, yo, college experience, some of the best years of your life, whatever. You know what I'm saying? I, I advise if they want to go to school to go to school, but go away. You know what I'm saying? So A said, Not for me. So I'm like, Where well, you go to school? <laughs> he said, S C C C C C C Hudson Valley C C C C I said, Oh, that's why nigga you went to school around the corner. <laughs> I said, You better go to school in here in the detention center. <laughs> you went to, you went to high school. I'm like, bro, you was better off going with no, 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 high school. Bro, I said he was better off going with Miss L, Miss O, Miss A. Oh shit. <laughs> no, no, he was better off going to the hood. He could have went to Snug, he could have went anywhere. Snug is crazy. <laughs> Yeah, shut bro. up, y'all. Nah, y'all that, that, that Cause I was talking about you because I'm like, damn, McGinn got shut down two years oh. ago. <laughs> the, the, the U's college the same road. I'm like, nigga, don't have no alma mater. Nothing. I tell his kids. Nothing. Like, I don't got shit to show And I kids. brought up the fact that the McGinn hoodies was in Dollar Tree. That's the thing is, no, 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 like 20 no, no, first, of all, first of all, it was Family Dollar, not Dollar Tree. Okay. The same thing. They're cousins. Family Dollar. Yeah, they were. Family Dollar bougie cousins. But look, St. Rose, though, they got a Nike contract and their gear is Fire, so where's it going? Sheesh. I'm about to have to pull up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, right. said I need that because that's what McGinn was doing when they gave away all of the old gear and all them old Facts. trophies. I was like, Yo, if you want, just come here and get it. My pop Sheesh. said, Bro, I need you to go back to St. Rose and get your jersey so we can frame it because. I can't. Yo, why? What? Yeah, think about that though. Yeah, but why? Are, I didn't even get to read the article. I just so, was like, Niggas ain't going to, little so, going to school. Do the funding. Niggas ain't going to school. So do the funding. <laughs> Well, St. Rose, I went back in 2011, and it was like 50-something thousand a year. Mm. It's yes. gone Damn. up like at least 10 grand since then, a year. So, in 2023 now, a lot of kids aren't enrolling into college. Mm -hmm. So, St. Rose is a private school one. It's That's mad costly, and it don't got nearly the electives and the classes and courses that like a SUNY got. That's why I said so a lot I, of I, kids. I them so and just to get into school is super yeah. like... They, they like your GPA and all of that stuff. They, it's like the accolades that get in is tough. Yep. So they just and then they've been struggling financially for years. It's, That's it's like been CNN. since I've been there for real. CNN so finally, the, the 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 board the board of elect they was like, yo, just shut it down at the Damn. end of the, the, uh, the end of the year crazy. in May. So when they graduate, it's clip everything done. Yes. So I think honestly, I think SUNY going to buying that whole block. You wouldn't know better than me, and maybe a because I went to college. But <laughs> what does that do to kids that's on scholarship? They got to transfer out. They probably would get their year back. They, they might they, get their. They would have to pay it now. They got to pay in the pocket though, because that scholarship might not transfer to another school. Nah, you no, can transfer yeah, to yeah. another school. I was going to. I was going to no, transfer to Siena. What I'm saying is because you you don't get the same money from every school. So if 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 St. Rose gave me sixty thousand dollars to go there, but then the other school was only going to give me thirty or forty thousand. Nah, 000. nah, you no, would go somewhere. You could transfer to another school that are like yeah, give you a full ride. A lot of the scholarships too are probably not school specific. <laughs> So the thing is, I ain't gonna lie. As an athlete, if I was hooping there right now, I'm already looking at another school. Yeah, yeah, I'm shopping yeah, yeah. right now. Bro, I finished the year, but I'm shopping right now. Dead like I'm even talking. Like say I, I play like uh, Southern Connecticut because that's what, like a tough I'll school they play. Like yo, bro, and their their system is dope. Like you just got kind of got freedom to just ball. I'll go out there. You know what I'm saying? I'll go out there, yeah. but it, it all depends, bro. But um, 
Yeah, but tough. this is a cycle though. Business is shutting down. Mm-hmm. You got all the shop rights shut online, down. Online, bro. Yeah, what the f- all the shop rights. Uh, somebody, so somebody it's not the area. It might. Not, it, is it the area these stores is located? Uh, it's not, in? Yeah, it's uh, not really. school. You, you said it. Niggas ain't going to school. Your niggas yeah, not going to school. Bro. On, everything online, bro. COVID backfired. The government thought COVID was going to do something to help them. And let's be honest, it backfired on them. Mm. It did, because now everybody is work. entrepreneurial. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. They made about too much free cash yeah. work. and work. made all the jobs remote. Work from <laughs> home, yeah. Did y'all see the article going around about the um, stimulus that was supposed to be coming out yesterday? Yeah. Yeah. Do you say people was really sharing that shit? Yeah. I ain't like, believe that's, in that's, shit. that's the crazy shit. That's how bad, like two thousand dollars. They be working ready. Yeah, was going, like that shit's gonna go in a day. Twelve hundred stimulus. They was, going, they was going crazy yesterday trying to find the article. And I'm like, bro, that's not real. Can we make more than like twelve hundred more so I can get my money back from my tires? Like that's, <laughs> like, what, that's what I'm saying. Like, like, that's like, gonna go in a day. That's now, groceries. Now we wonder why. <laughs> but but uh, my point would be, all right. So y'all want the twelve hundred dollars, right? Y'all beasting for the twelve hundred. But then y'all mad that the stores are shut down. There's nobody working. Right. Y'all mad about self checkout. Y'all mad about all these different things. But here's why: because y'all keep getting free money, sitting on your ass, don't go nowhere. Kids see it. God they don't want to go to school. Everybody's an entrepreneur. Everybody got an e-commerce store. Everybody got a podcast. Niggas want that PPP to come back. That's what it really. Is. Niggas want that PPP to come back. Uh, hey, if it do, I'm not missing it. That's what that's that's so, what it really is. Fuck right the twelve. Now. They want that twenty. They that, want them yeah, I, I won't miss that. Again. I'm definitely uh, opening nigga, the business I, I, with that PPP. I won't though. miss that again. But that's really what it is. Niggas ain't going to school. Um, niggas ain't spending money. Niggas ain't going mm. to stores. Nah, it's clip. No, they niggas really ordering. Ordering. Go stores, ordering. Niggas. Niggas go Black Friday. Did anybody go Black Friday? Nah, that shit was empty. I didn't. I made one stop. Pass me by. It's another Friday. I made one stop. I pulled up. I said, oh, they gone? Uh, home immediately. Did you see Shorty TikTok when she went to Target? And it was empty? No. And she was pulling the... The, the, t- the, the prices? T- the prices from behind. Oh, yeah. Behind. And it showed the same exact same, same price. Same exact With a price. different sign. Word. Same exact Disrespectful. Price. Word. My man. I know they jumped her after that. So on no, Twitter. They jump her. Nah. Target going through backlash because of that. That's, 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 that's what I'm saying. Thing. Somebody call her like same Power the internet. Same thing with Best Buy. Power the internet. Call me from Best Buy. He um he got fired or some shit. So like, well, I'm exposed these niggas. Got on Twitter and was like, "Yo, don't go to Best Buy on Black Friday because the night before, because you know they don't open on Thanksgiving. Right. So that whole day they get a bunch of workers and they have them clear the entire floor of all the good shit and then mm. bring out they get a truckload of like damage, like not damage, but like refurbished yeah. bullshit. Right, refurbished. put that on the floor and sell that to you, That's and then bring crazy. out the, the new shit yeah. mm. when the sales is over. Yeah. I said, God, that is crazy. I definitely Damn. believe it. The hustle no. is real. God that is damn. crazy. I believe it. Mm. Black Friday is that bad? Yeah, it's and, different. Over and the years, because it got exposed. Cyber Everybody Monday knows. mean more. Yeah, better stop. Yeah, niggas yeah. would rather wait for Cyber, Cyber Monday. Monday mean more. Yeah, yeah, better stop Friday. playing with these uh these employees, bro. Y'all firing the wrong people. <laughs> 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 they giving out all the giving out all, all the sauce. Because what happened? They don't. There's no like NDA or like there's nope, none no, of that. When you it's clip. Fire nigga. It's clip. Oh, you want fire? Word. I'm uh, out of here. Especially like kitchens and shit. Yeah, like, boy from Fridays at yeah. Stardust and Plaza. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Remember when Shorty got fired from Papa? She was giving out the chicken recipe. Yo, boy, boy from Fridays at Stavis and took his phone in the that. back Yo, kitchen. That shit was disgusting. Yo. If I got fired from a, oh. a, a fast food restaurant, Yo. I'm giving out everything that's here. Bro, oh, Chick fil A? The, chi- the like Polynesian sauce recipe? I'm giving that up. Bro, that's gone. Homie, <laughs> homie, from Fridays, home. homie from Fridays went to that kitchen, bro, and recorded that. I was like, nah, never, mm. I'll never eat there it again. It was bro. nasty. It was real bad. That just, be like I said, bro. what the fuck? What is this? Shorty just said that about Snug like an hour ago. So yo, know, everybody been in the Snug building. So it's just more like a dead body in there. They got rats and roaches. I said, God Bro, what? damn. Which one? The one on what this corner or this corner? Now the one right here. There's two the of them. One right here for sale. Got two apartments really? over there too. Yeah, I thought yeah. about it. <laughs> said, about it. <laughs> but it's right in the hood. Oh though. yeah, and another, <laughs> another point. That's because the clip right you just played too. As far as like. uh you know, kids trying to go to the NBA over school. Yeah. How we need more doctors. I think the times just changed because if you think back to like in the 90s and 80s, the men like they want us to look up to were the guys who went to college, went, you know, got degrees, became doctors. Over time, I think people got younger and started getting richer at a younger age. So now kids seeing these 20 year olds that's getting $50,000. You know what I mean? Like, so it's like, oh, I don't got to go to that whole idea of I don't got to go to school to be successful and famous started getting bigger. And I think that's what made niggas like I don't gotta go to college, and, and then, I don't gotta go to work, and I don't gotta go to work. Seven jobs, and then yeah, it's like facts. 
Yeah, but like at social media, bro, like that shit makes niggas. The power to internet, yeah, bro. bro. Like niggas, like, oh, I can just do this from home all day and make ten thousand dollars a month. Oh, yeah, for go nothing. Like a lot of the game, even stuff like anything you really want to learn, bro, is one two clicks away. And then you got it in the bro. palm of your hands. Mm-hmm. So it's now it's like you don't gotta go to right. college to learn that. And then nine times out of ten, well, ten times out of ten, well, the stuff you really need to learn ain't in school. That's another thing. They not yeah. teach you that shit. Not yeah. no more anyway. Even yeah. if you go Yo. to school, say if you go to college for a business admin degree, mm-hmm. you can learn all that shit on YouTube. I think that's really Yo. what the kids found out. Yeah. With the shit that I'm going to school for, yep. I can, somebody's on YouTube or TikTok. Teach yeah. Yeah. I don't let my kids bro. watch YouTube. And see, we didn't have that access to the internet when we like as quick as they do. You know what I'm saying? We only got it when, from 3 o'clock when you got home before your mama got home and at 6 o'clock when you had to get off when she about to get on the phone. I want, you, I want you to finish that point though. <clears throat> Thankfully, Pop Pop passed that. He got well, yeah, he slipped okay, past, yeah, yeah, yeah. you know what I mean? But for the other two, dub. There, no, no YouTube. You don't let them get on. No, no That's iPad, good. no YouTube, no nothing because I don't... Callie said to me yesterday, Mom, I hate school. I don't want to go to school anymore. I said, here we go. No. And But that's why. Well, yeah, exactly. Because no. you'll, you'll think you'll... You don't know what they're watching. You don't know what they're listening to, right? Mm-hmm. So, even if it's not nothing crazy, it could just be subliminally just telling the kids, like... But kids are sponges. Yeah. It, or they'll they see the kids everything. on YouTube and say, oh, I could do that. I don't got to go to school because I could just be him. That right. kid don't go to school. He sit at home and play with toys all day, so right. I could do that. Yeah. It's like your dog, first of all. That's why I still don't like that the kid, Ryan, when he started out as this big, or like the Ryan's toy, mm-hmm. he's a grown-ass man, and he still makes videos for kids. I don't like that. I think it's mm-hmm. weird. Yeah. He been doing this shit for twelve years now, bro. Yeah, yeah. and get, I mean, man, bro. get into the bag too. I'm about to say he probably got so many endorsements and sponsorships it's, it's and partnership he got deals. And, he got and and pass a torch to somebody it's else. Fun. Exactly, mm-hmm. really a grown man still playing with kids' toys. That's a little do weird. Do something else. All you do is up the opportunity too. Like you giving it, passing the torch to somebody. Yeah. You got the bag. Some people bro. don't want to share that juice, bro. Some people, you know, they just like riding their own wave as long as they possibly can. They don't open that door for people. It's out there. I got a problem with that though. I don't think that. I don't think people. Who don't share the information can preach black excellence or I'm for black people. Because mm. if you mm. always if you're always gonna charge for the knowledge, you can't be for black. It's people. crazy right. shit that because y'all that then young thug say that about Jay Z. He's like before we die, before Jay Z die, he should tell everybody how to become a billionaire. That's for a but he already right? did though. See, really thank you. He already Hove, did Hove in the music, it. right? Yeah, Hovis said it a million times. It's in the music. Right. It's in the interviews. Just go listen. It's in the right. interviews. It's in the music. Do and it's physically, you see it's change, bro. Do y'all listen to music or do y'all just skip That's the through? thing. I, I think yeah, I think that was Thug's point. He's like, because a lot of people don't go listen don't to Hov. Because he, he, he that old head. Like a lot of niggas don't go listen to that. I can't tell you how to be a billionaire. Right. Right. I can't tell you how to be a billionaire. Right. Like, because if you ask any millionaire, and I've asked plenty of them, they'll always tell you. The hardest million is your first. first after mm-hmm. that, nigga, they get it's come. Mm-hmm. Yeah. They just come back to back to back after that. Because you know how to make But the hardest one is the first. A lot of niggas don't got the work ethic. You can't get to a billion if you can't get to a million. Yeah. Right. You can't show you how to make a billion dollars. No, I, that's not whole, and that's not his responsibility. At least, what, but what about as far as at least just sharing the knowledge on like well, for people where to look? He's been doing that. He's been, he's been doing, doing that. And he's, and he's make, been making mistakes doing it. So he's so, showing us the fuck ups. And the thing yeah. is, he said it himself. Take the money. Don't take no interview with me. Word. I'm, I'm so glad he said that shit. I give you the like. With all the so respect, take the money, bro. Shit. Oh, hold up. Damn. No, yeah, he said, pay, he said take that money. Pay the eleven ninety nine or whatever. Because I had a question for that. <laughs> then listen. Um, because it was as far as when you said you don't let your kids right now, you know, indulge in YouTube and the social media. I was always curious because. I'm just here so I won't get fired.